it has been a minute since I have been fly fishing. I got so busy for the last four weeks. The last time I fished was that uh, last video I did in Vermont. That's the last time I went fly fishing. And I've been getting really antsy, so finally things slowed down a little bit. Um, I'm out here in New Hampshire, one of my favorite spots up in the White Mountains. Um, because I was busy for like four weeks, I don't really have a clue what the conditions are going to be like, so I'm a little nervous. I keep choosing to go to the wrong spots at the wrong time, which has been really frustrating. I'm here now, the water already looks kind of low. So I'm not really sure what to expect. Um, but I've had really good luck here in the past. And if this uh, stretch doesn't work out, I've got a few other spots. But man, it is just good to be out here. I just can't even begin to express how good it feels to be back in the waders, be on the river. Oh, here we go. Let's try to catch some trout, man. There's a few brook trout right down there. Nice little brook trout, nice little brook trout. All right, we're gonna let him go. So normally, upriver, there's usually a bunch of brookies now, but there's a nice deep hole right there, and I can see a bunch of little brookies in them, so we're gonna see if we can pull a bunch of brookies out of this hole. Another tiny little brook trout, little brook trout. Tiny little brook trout. All right, so there's about, there's about 25 little brook trout sitting right in there. There is like so many. Getting a little bigger, getting a little bigger. Okay, that was epic. I really needed that morale booster. Not that there was like a ton of skill involved because they were just eating everything, but if I went home right now, I would be totally happy. Um, that spot was unbelievable. I'm like just so happy. Um, I shut the camera off and just caught like five more because I just didn't want to have to worry about filming it. But I mean, if I stayed there, I probably could have got like a hundred of them. There were so many. Um, I love New Hampshire fishing. There's just something special about it. Just, I love it. And I even got like, we've got so much more time day left, so I'm gonna walk uh, down river, try a few spots, 
and then I'm camping tonight and there's a river that I am camping on that's kind of a 50 50 shot so we're gonna see but man I'm just what a great day all right not a bad day back at the campground got the rooftop tent back there the CVT rooftop tent really really good day um, I got a bunch of brookies the first spot then I went to this bridge I got a few hits I basically basically caught them um, they were tiny and I went to take them off and they jumped off then I went to another spot after that didn't see a thing um, I was trying to decide what I wanted to do next and then I made a last minute decision to drive like a half hour to another spot and I found another pool with a bunch of rainbow trout and uh, I fished that for probably an hour and a half and got probably 20 hits and I just could not get them to um, to set like I just I had really good hook sets but just could not get them and then finally um, I wasn't filming because I was just so exhausted I just but I did get one rainbow trout uh, at the end which was very exciting so really good day I'm just gonna hang around I can't decide if I'm gonna fish tomorrow or where I'm gonna fish tomorrow but I'm just gonna enjoy the fire hop in the uh, rooftop tent and go to sleep love camping love fishing